We've got Little Big Planet. Yeah. Jinx. Oh. And Little Big Planet 2. So these are just all the PlayStation games. Oh, yeah. We've got the one Western game we've never played at all. Yeah. And then Red oh, Dead yeah. Redemption, which we actually have played. And then Ghostbusters. Which we haven't played. We played because it's, it's, it's kind of scary and a little difficult. <laughs> so these are kind of like the GameCube games that will most likely get played. Oh, boy. Sonic and the Strong Bad yeah. Email collections right there too. Yeah. Now we're starting to get into DVDs. The same thing that you can watch on the internet except in a DVD in a form. DVD. See this one has Domestar on the cover. That, that doesn't sound like... <laughs> that doesn't sound At like... At least you tried. Okay. Anyway. So we got Freakazoid Season mm -hmm. 1 and Season 2. This is Tism's Tism. White Album. Tism is basically an alternative rock band like, consisting of uh, band members whose identities have been hidden at least during the time they were around. They're not around anymore. But this is basically a DVD CD collection. And it, the uh, middle one being the album. <clears throat> and uh, then we've got like a documentary about Tism and then the quote unquote last live performance. Mm -hmm. it, it doesn't play on the PS3. No, it doesn't play because this is a region free <clears throat> DVD. So and then this is Count Ducula of all things. Oh yeah. So yeah. Here are all the Sam and Max games, season one, season two, and season of the Devil's Playhouse. Super Dave. Oh boy. The movie. Future by Design. Jack Fresco and all of his designs of uh, futuristic technologies and stuff like that. I'm an Epcot fan, so but yeah. it's entertaining. <clears throat> Tales from the Crypt Keeper, the Nelvana television series. And this is season one which is just the Crypt Keeper. Here's the second season, which features uh, the Crypt Keeper, the Vault Keeper, and the Old Witch from the actual comics. And mm. this is the only series HBO never attempted to bring back the other two ghoul lunatics, but uh, this series did. I usually try to find any unique thing that is out there on the internet, and this is probably one of the first. This is, I forget his name, um, I think his name is, he Mike calls him, pod. but his name is Matt, I think, oh. which is kind of ironic, yeah. you know, yeah. um, which is kind of like uh, Strong Bad, uh, Homestar Runner, and yeah, they're both Mike and Matt, so. Yeah, a lot know. of Mike and Matt's out there. We get tired of it pretty quickly, but this is John's Arm, Armageddon, based on four animated shorts by Mike the Pod. This is your definitive, I'm going to write a script and I'm going to animate it all by myself. Here's yeah, another here guy, Sam T. Sam T, yeah. With his unbelievably <clears throat> messed up Bible stories, and this isn't so much a movie as it is a collection of his Flash animated shorts. And it's also signed, if you can kind of see it there, I don't know if you're gonna, gonna be able it's to see it. It's kind of a glare, but yeah. But it's signed. Yeah, I, I like this. I would recommend <clears throat> it. I would uh, recommend his Taco Man stuffs um, as well. The website for Shulks has been pretty subdued over the years. It's been discussed, um, I think recently, that they're trying to get an animated series. Um, and I would love them to get an animated series. But this is the original Flash animated series on DVD. Oh boy, there's the sticker too. Mm -hmm. This is like the second set. They had a first set and I was like, well, I, I want to get it, but financially I wasn't there. And then they it was sold out. And then um, they <coughs> finally decided to make another one and I immediately went to purchase it because they also mentioned this one was going to be out of print. Now these two are interesting. Oh, yeah. How to Spin Toy Guns by Hot Shot Johnny Tuscadero, which is also known as Jonathan Manx. If you don't know who Jonathan Manx is, he's he's the guy who's also made this, which is another DVD. John Dillinger was captured at the Hotel Congress in, a, in when, uh, Tucson, Arizona. Uh, yeah. Chicago couldn't do that. You can, and, uh, they, they have that in Public Enemies, too, but they just really kind of blow yeah, by it. Yeah, they blared through that thing. Uh, I would not recommend Public Enemies. I would recommend this, though. It's yeah, a little this, bit... This goes more into... It's not as historically detail. accurate, yeah. but it, it pays attention to it, where the movie does not, and it's actually filmed at the place it occurred. 
John's done that, and he's also done, if you know my channel, um, Nightfall at Old Tucson Studios. He created the characters and the original idea back in 1990. And this is signed, I'll shoot you later. It probably has something to do with Nightfall. Um, but and we can't be too sure. I gotta say, this is actually a really good DVD. I mean, even uh -huh. though he's using toy guns, the techniques he's doing... You can apply them to real guns once you get the hand strength down. Yeah. You know? if, if you're into that sort of thing, I'd pick it up. Um, support the Western arts and support John, because who knows? There might be a Nightfall movie in the future. Oh, boy. <laughs> so here's some of my Shout Factory stuff. I've got the Sam and Max animated series. Sonic Underground, The Adventures of Sonic, and just Sonic the Hedgehog. The, uh, I have this uh, Blu-ray Ninja Turtles box set. Supposed to be like a pizza. Oh, is it really Blu-ray? Yeah, it's and it's got like a little menu, which has some of the bonus, bonus that stuff in it. That is adorable. And a little comic book. Wow. And I just wanted to point out the pizzas. The first movie is a pepperoni pizza. Classic. Your classic pepperoni pizza. The second movie, it's a little bit kind of veggie. And then if you look at the third movie, it's a plain cheese pizza because it's cheesy. And no, then of course. Good. There's uh, Turtles Forever. Oh yeah, there you go. Danger Mouse. This the is whole box pretty set. good. These three right here are, are documentaries. Tales from the Crypt, the comic book. Mm -hmm. uh, documentary, the cartoonist, about Jeff Smith. This one is a documentary on Smile. Brian Wilson Smile, which talks about the, uh, the alleged album of 1967 that never was, and uh, a live performance of uh, that music. Then we've got the nerd. We've oh, got yeah. the nerd DVDs. Every One through nerd. four. Now right here is the original box set for Full Moon's Puppet Master collection. This is Puppet Master one through retro. And this came out a long time ago when I found out that the Puppet Master movies were going to come out on DVD. Um, I pre-ordered it on Amazon. I got it in and then I found out that, hey, the uh, box sets were being pulled because they were in it, there was issues with Paramount and Full Moon about uh, the rights. This is the original box set. I, I hold on to it. All the films from one to retro, including Legacy, which is just kind of like a clip show. Also, uh, a different thing with this collection is that the first film is digitally remastered and in its original widescreen format, which they never were able to do back when it first came out for home video. So it's, it's kind of a bonus, and uh, I like that. And then there's also Demonic Toys back here. Oh, you have is, Demonic Toys? Yeah. So I've got all the Dollman films, and I've got all the Puppet Master films, and I've got... The Puppet Master versus Demonic Toys film. And who's in that movie? Who plays the Doctor? Oh God! Um, What's his name? Corey Feldman. Corey Feldman, yeah. Worst and then actor. this is Dolls, which is the precursor to Puppet Master, which has Guy Rolfe, who ended up being the yeah, he was the Puppet Master, Puppet Master three. in the third one. Yeah, this one's okay. I like it as much as I like the original Puppet Master films because of its use of stop motion. David Allen, and I think it works with the Puppet Master films because they're puppets. You know, it kind of... Yeah, it has the same look. You know, it has that, that cheat to it. 